In a class of five students, the average weight of the four lightest students is 40. Average weight of the four heaviest students is 45. What is the difference between the maximum and minimum possible average overall? Very simple. You can capture the data slightly differently and then build it from there. Let's say we have A, B, C, D, E to be the weights in increasing order. The four smallest or the four lightest ones average is 40 or total of all four is 160. Total of the, the top five or the four heaviest ones is 180 kilograms with the average is 45. Four quantities average is 45, total should be 180. Right? Now, total of everything put together, I can think of it as 160 plus E or 180 plus A. 160 is the bottom four or the lightest four plus E or 180 is the top five plus A. Right? Total of all four, 160 plus A should be equal to one, 160 plus E should be equal to 180 plus A. In this, we get that E is A plus 20. The heaviest of the five is 20 kilograms heavier than the lightest of the five. That much we know. Now let's go to the next idea. We want to find out, I'm just going to recap this. We want to find out E is 20 more than A. We want to find out the maximum possible average. Maximum possible average will depend on maximum value for E. If you think of it as 160 plus E, which will depend on maximum value of A. Now, average weight of the four lightest students is 40 and the lightest among them is A. The maximum value A can take is 40 or we would have A maximum when A, B, C, D are 40, 40, 40, 40, 40. Now, E is 20 more than A, E should be 60. Now, this satisfies all conditions. This will be the scenario where the average will be maximum or the average will be 220 by 5, which is 44 kilograms. Now, do the same thing for the minimum. Think about minimum value. Minimum would be minimum when 180 plus A is the least or when A is the minimum. We need to find when A would be minimum or we need to find when E would be minimum. Now, the average weight of the heaviest four is 45. E is the heaviest of these four. So, the minimum weight E can take is 45. In which case, D would be 45. C would be 45. Sorry. B would be 45. And A would be 20 less than E, which would be 25. Now, average of all of these. 45 into 4 is 180 plus 25 is 205 by 5, which is 41 kilograms. So the maximum possible average is 44, which will happen when the weights are 40, 40, 40, 40 and 60. The minimum possible average is 41, which would happen when the weights are 25, 45, 45, 45, 45. The difference between maximum and minimum is 44 kilograms minus 41 kilograms, which is 3 kilograms. Whatever answer choice. That, that corresponds to. Right? So, it's a wonderful question. The thing about maximum and minimum, again, we are playing with what values can they take and then substituting those values and then finding the missing number. Right? A lot of questions and averages tend to be more inference driven than algebra driven. So, you need to stay on top of how to approach these kind of questions.